Hello guys and I'm going to show you how to make 3D shapes out of clay and matches. Okay, my pen is falling a lot. Okay, so let's see guys. As you can see, first I have to take out my clay dough so it does not dry. And if you, first of all, before I remove it, I want to tell you that you could even use glue tag over here. I can show you over here glue tag. But the thing in glue tag is that they cannot dry. So if it, if clay dough can dry, I mean clay dough can dry actually. So it will put them stable and they're not moved. So they can stay there and not break anytime. But with the glue tag, they might break because the glue tag cannot dry for sticking things up. So if you have, you can use glue tag, but it's better to use it. And I'm using matches, but if you have toothpicks, it's good. You can even use toothpicks because I don't have toothpicks. I'm not using toothpicks. Anyways, so I have to break this out. Now, the box of matches and some of our clay. Any color you would like. I mean, any color I would like. Of course, every little girl in life would like pink, but I like purple. So I'm taking blue by the first. Uh huh, this is hard to get out. Uh -huh. Okay. Here we have the clay. And now we are rolling it into a circle. Turn that into a circle either. Two, I mean. It's not a big small, so I don't know. So, see. Then turn this to in a circle, two circles with that. Cool. Oh, here yeah, with two circles. Then you have to take a box of matches. Matches. Okay. And then we have to take out one of those. Add them together. And then. We need to take more, add it over here. Yeah. Then we need to take one more and add over here. First of all, you know what shape, what three D shape we are making? We are making a three D shape which is called cube. Good job for making a cube. <laughs> Yeah, it's fine. Ta da da! I got you something cute! And I'm gonna add more matches. And then we'll need to add that, and we'll need to add that. Now we have purple. I think that the purple will look such a good one here, actually. And then we can do one more dark blue, that's totally okay to me. We can then need the black one with that. Done. You could get some mix up colors this time. Is it fine if I? You can make it the way you would like, but I'm just mixing the colors up. Because, like this. And then I think we don't need any more. How do we need it for the next shape? Of course. We will. We now mostly will need only one thing, which is called chopsticks. Still can. It is called matches. Matches. Sounds funny. I am a chatter box. Now, adding these clays. Oh, yeah. We get a cube. Well, I've been breaks all the time. We better not move this till it dries. Next shape is called. And then a stick. Again, it's not a stick actually. We call it a matchy smatches. And then we need a lot of these. Getting pushed. Yeah, we push it. Two works. One of these middles. And then it gets always pushed. If we can put any side push, it gets pushed. Just putting that side. And it gets So, 
Yeah. And then that was a little noise, but that's totally okay because it was a weird noise. So. Yeah, it's okay. Um, this is our next shape, you can see. Uh huh, and I keep it. Uh, I'll just take out some matches so it doesn't take me a lot of time to do many matches. And then doing it with matches, you have to actually be a little bit careful. You know these side of this boxes? You can see? If you just curb it, the fire will come. Okay. First, we need to rub the clay in this one into circle. It takes a lot of time to do that, you know. Go ahead over here. Okay, we're taking those around over here. And you know what? Oh, they only need so less. Quite a slender, like a lot of those. You have to pull here by here if you can. Thank you. You have to be very light with these, so if they break up, they you have to do all again. I've used a lot. Here we go. Uh -huh. Oh, I'm gonna finish this whole match box. That's so interesting. Guys, I'm going to try to make one more shape, and my shape is up and down with the shape. I'm not going to slender. It'll take a lot of time to make a slender. You know why? Slenders and these. It's going to be very tall for you. And I'm already making it. <laughs> Just a singing piece. Huh? Uh, making it fun. Now, I'm going to make a bit more touchy shape in there. And now. I need to mix these two to make a little fat layer. These are like so much data with uh second in time. So this much clay to use it. Super duper careful when you're making this. Then we need to use one of these to really use it like this. Totally like this. And then we have to do more. We how many we are using. I don't know will I be able to make that shape. This is so good. Come on, cake, 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 Oh, cake. I said the word cake. It's not my first word anyways. So it's nothing for me to be. It's really weird. Now and I want more of these. Really, what is happening? I need so many. And now, guys, we need to take a dash one like this, one like this. This is just a child, the one I'm making with you now, guys. This one is actually good at it. <laughs> I'm trying to make it good. But let's, let's just see if I'll be able to make it. Almost on the set, yay! Just need more. What? I want to finish one of the matches boxes. That's so surprising for me. Super duper surprising for me. Yeah, and we can take out some of these matches. We only need more clay. And here's all our clay is left over here. And we are making it over here. Stick on that clay back to my hands. And yeah, almost 
done with this shape. And I'm super, super happy that I'm able to make this shape. And I'll be happy too. That's how much happy you were when I the floor is not there. But this one's the least. I remember that. Just forgot that. Okay, and. Done! I made it! This is a big one. So, there we made it. Thank you for watching my video. Press up when you're done making it. Like this.